A decade ago, Shinnecock Bay was called irrecoverable, shellfish and water health in a downward spiral. CBS 2's Jennifer McLogan reports the collapse was reversed with science and students, and the environmental recovery is being lauded across the country. This is the sound of progress. It means basically, you know, job security. Ed Warner is a fifth generation Shinnecock Bayman. We had the brown tide, we lost the base scallops, we lost many of the hard clams, and the whole ecosystem had changed for the worse. Uh, and now? And now it's, it's come back. More than a decade after we first covered the pollution, die offs, suffocating algae, red and brown tide, considered more intense than any other waterway worldwide, Stony Brook scientists are getting global recognition for the restoration of Shinnecock Bay. This is incredible news. Clams live for more than 40 years, so they'll be filtering the water, providing new baby clams. Led by Dr. Christopher Gobler, sustained efforts of researchers, students, philanthropists, and volunteers created, planted, sustained clam sanctuaries, oyster reefs, seagrass beds, salt marshes, and intertidal flats amid the 9,000 acres of open water making up Shinnecock Bay in the town of Southampton. What we've seen is a 1,700% increase in hard clam densities in the bay, and the outcome we hadn't even dreamed of in the beginning. The international designation depicts Shinnecock as arguably the healthiest bay in New York State. Their work demonstrates that science and people can reverse the damage. Environmentalists call it a pushback to climate change. Optimism is the word of the day. This is a heroic event. A complete recovery of the clam fishery and ecosystem through sacrifice. Our next goal is to be able to, you know, make sure that the base scallops can survive. A significant coastline, rich maritime tradition, ocean wildlife back above and under the sea. From Shinnecock Bay, Long Island, Jennifer McLogan, CBS 2 News. That is amazing, Lonnie. Right? You so betcha. encouraging. All of those mollusks, be it you know an, an oyster, a clam, uh, scallops, they're they're all like filters. They're like the mm -hmm. they're like the, the like the they're like the, the kidneys and the livers of our ocean. That's what they do. They filter the water and then just clean it right up.